Hello guys, how you doing? So, I'm going to watch episode 777 of One Piece today and I'm curious to see what's going to happen now since Luffy and his group are already leaving Zo and on their way to the um, uh, World Cake Island. I'm still not too sure about how he's uh, like going to land with his group since he just grabbed all of them and then jumped so hopefully he will have uh, um, a plan for that. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to see what's going to happen during uh, all of these different um, uh, situations. So uh, with Luffy's group and uh, like the, the remaining uh, three groups. Um, but yeah, there was also this moment by the end of uh, the episode showing uh, Vivi. So that was uh, um, a big surprise and uh, it made me uh, like wonder about... Uh, why exactly they were uh, showing her. Um, but then I started remembering that there's um, a really important uh, uh, meeting about to happen, right? Between um, all the leaders um, of this world. So I have the idea that um, this is going to be about uh, uh, this, so uh, this meeting. And uh, I believe... Um, I'm not too sure if Fujitora was also going to join or not, but... Uh, he was the first one who mentioned, um, like, wanting uh, to be there, or at least uh, he wanted to take that chance to try and change uh, this system and even get rid of, um, like, the Warlord system. Um, but yeah, it's definitely something that I'm curious about, and hopefully they will um, show more details uh, about this, because I don't remember in, um, like, the first time Fujitora mentioned this, I don't remember in how long it was going to happen. So I don't remember if it was like uh, one month or um, uh, more. So uh, I don't know, it's uh, maybe about uh, to happen. So that's uh, maybe why they are showing uh, Vivi and she's uh, like probably going to be there. Um, but yeah, just uh, really can't wait to find out um, about it. So hope you guys are ready and let's start this episode. And I saw that scene again, and there was um, a navy ship um, there, so I don't know if they're going to be as, like escorted or something like that. Yeah, this. I was thinking that like, Luffy was going to become a balloon and... That would prevent their fall, literally. Oh, they're resuming here. Showing more of it. I don't remember the exact name they they call this uh, meeting. Best princess. Yeah, I'm becoming more and more sure that it's about this. And of course, uh, it's going to be really important. Oh, there's Koza. Man, this was so long ago, this arc. It's hard to remember everyone, but the moment they show them, they instantly come to mind. Oh, it's her, Ina. Damn, it's been a while. Oh, Django. These two! They were working there already. Man, she's so beautiful. Oh. 
Well, she doesn't have it anymore. I guess it got removed. I was actually wondering about this. If the others still have it or not. I mean, it doesn't really matter because... It's just a mark. What matters is what's... Like, they're bond. Showing a bit of the past. I still remember, this was such an emotional arc. Damn, Crocodile. That's Luffy, right? I believe he was... I still remember he was pierced by Crocodile on his chest. He was still able to survive. And then this was him... coming back after recovering, right? And the guy is riding as well. He was assu uh, like assumed dead at some point, but he actually survived, so that was something that made me really happy. I believe he sacrificed himself. He was stopping some bombs, right, from falling on the city. It's like he sacrificed himself trying to stop one of those bombs. But he was able to live. I don't know if they're going to show that or not. Like, just some things that I remember. And this was also a really important arc. I mean... It was after this that Robin joined their their crew. Also the first time Luffy defeated the warlord, right? So he got a lot more uh, tension. A lot more eyes set on him. Even though it was covered, so... I think that actually happened. The navy just... Just pretended... It was them, and not the Straw Pirates, defeating 
crocodile. Not like pretendant. Can't remember the right word. Pretty much lied to everyone. Drain. Man, I love Vivi so much. Definitely one of my favorites. Got so attached to her during all of this. Really hope they get to see each other again at some point. Damn that frame! It was uh, a lot more real than the usual. I don't know how to explain it, but the animation was really good. These. Damn, look at the going Mary. Some mixed feelings, I mean, so happy to see her again, but... Well knowing what happened. Damn this music. And I'm getting all emotional again. Pretty sure they can't wait to see you again. That was really smart of Nami. Just going to lift their arms right, showing the... the cross. That's going to say everything. You don't need words. But yeah, I'm not too sure if they still have that or not. It's I haven't been paying attention to this specific detail. We just saw how Vivi was remembering it, but then it vanished, so... It's like the ink eventually disappeared. Yeah, again, it doesn't really matter because... What matters is how they feel about each other. And they will never forget that. Well, I mean, after seeing what Fujitora does, I wouldn't be surprised, but it's not like he would do something like that. Just funny that they mentioned meteors falling. Oh, damn, it's her father. Also a great guy. Oh, that was the name, Reverie. And this confirms it. That's what's going to happen now. 
Ooh. Oh no, that's Wonder what's I mean, if they're even going to tell him anything, I don't think so. Oh my god. Hopefully not. He's not doing so well right now. He became older, of course, but... Hope he gets to live a lot longer. Broke Town! Oh, it's Low Town! Oh. oh, this happens every four years. I don't remember if that was mentioned or not. Fancy place. The Queen of Goa Kingdom. King Stelly. Okay then. That's a uh, quite the first impression of this guy. And this is going to be really big. Fifty nations. Yeah, I can imagine. Oh, don't change out. The guys from before, they were at they were at the dress rosa. Ryugu Kingdom, Fishman Island. I got Shiroshi! She's going to appear! Oh my god, she's so adorable! I'm so happy! Cute as always. Oh. Hmm. It's going to show some... Oh, this promise. I mean, she's perfect the way she is.
It's a really big pinky. <laughs> Man, she's so perfect. Otohime. It's so nice to see some of these guys again. Wait, they're already. What happened? Is that because of what Luffy did? <laughs> like, it is. How did they even land? <laughs> oh my god. Sure. <laughs> All the time. <laughs> And that really affected them. Oh. It's Carrot! Wait, she came? And <laughs> Luffy didn't even notice. Wait, she eat on their ship? Oh my god, this is so perfect! <laughs> I can't believe she's actually going! Man, so much to think about during this episode! It just makes me really happy, I mean, there was that thing about Pedro and Wanda wanting to go, but uh, now it's only going to be Pedro and Peckham's as well. Um, but uh, I was not too sure if some others were going to join, so... I still remember there was that um, specific moment with Carrot um, like thinking about... Um, how she really wanted to, um, to travel and stuff and to see some new places. So apparently she decided to do this. She decided to hide in their ship and go with them. So I don't know how they're going to feel about that. But I mean, this makes me really happy because you guys probably noticed just how much I already like her. So it's going to be really nice to, um, to have her around as well. Um, but yeah, she's still going um, like to a dangerous place, so hopefully nothing too bad uh, will happen um, w with her. And again, she's um, like it's like they will have uh, someone else to care um, about. So if something ends up happening with her, of course, uh, like Luffy and the others are going to have um, uh, uh, to save her. But I mean, what I'm trying to say is that um, like she can be in danger and. Uh, I don't want to say that um, she will be like um, bad for them in a way that uh, she might um, like make them change their plans or something if something ends up happening. I don't know how to exactly explain it. Um, but yeah, either way, just need to hope um, uh, for the best. And uh, I am definitely really curious to see what's going to happen during uh, the Raviary. Uh, Raviary, right? That's the name. I don't know how to pronounce it. Um, but um, I don't know what's going to happen there, so it's definitely going to be really important and uh, there's going to be um, like leaders from a lot of uh, these nations uh, uh, there to um, like to talk, so they're going to um, talk about... Um, I'm not too sure about what, but it's like it involves the things happening at the world and to decide uh, some stuff, um, but there's also some of them... Uh, wanting to know more about some specific things. So, Cobra was curious about um, what um, the Nefertari uh, family um, did uh, some years ago or something, like some sort of a decision. So, it's probably something that the world government wouldn't uh, share, considering how they are trying to hide a lot of stuff uh, from um, everyone in the world. Um, but yeah, this is already implying that um, it's going to be... Like, I don't know... I was going to say wild, and I don't know how far I am um, uh, from it, because just like the narrator was saying, um, these kind of reunions don't uh, really go smoothly uh, when they happen, so uh, there's definitely going to be um, a lot of... Um, like, not definitely, but there's probably going to be a lot of moments with uh, these leaders going against uh, each other and not uh, uh, agree agreeing with um, what the others say. So definitely going to be um, interesting to see um, what uh, will happen. And I don't know 
when they will show it, because right now they are preparing for it and everyone is um, like going to uh, Marie Joie to um, take uh, part on this uh, like reunion or so to say. So yeah, I really can't wait to, um, to watch it and um, to see like more of the others as well. I mean, there's currently, uh, currently a lot happening. So these four groups doing their own thing. There's uh, uh, this reunion happening between uh, all of the leaders. So it's like... Um, it, it really gives me the feeling that something big is going to happen. I don't know what exactly, but during this reunion, it, it really feels like um, there's going to be some uh, big uh, decisions. Uh, like, I'm not too sure how to put it, but uh, in the end, I'm just going to have to wait and see what ends up happening during, um, during it. Um, but yeah, either way, just, um, again, really can't wait to find out um, about uh, a lot more of this. So, hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this episode. And if you did, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And you can also join my Discord and my Patreon if you want to get early access to my full reactions. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.